Everyone's starting to panic. They say they want to go back to Reach for fuel. We keep going. But sir, there's... There's fuel back on Reach, and... If we get there quick enough... Are you questioning my orders, Alexander? Reach is gone. I said we keep going. This is my decision, not yours. Yes, sir. I'll... I'll let the others know your orders. I need to know something before you go. What is it, sir? Alexander, do you remember when there was no war? Come again, sir? No war, no conflict, no covenant, no insurrection, nothing. To be honest, Charles, I... I don't. I asked the ODST yesterday on the same topic. You mean ODST, Joseph? Yes. Well, what did Joseph say? He said the exact same thing you did. I don't, sir. Why are you asking me this, Charles? I want to know if we're still human. Never really thought about it until now. Do you have a opinion on war? No, sir. Why not? I do what's necessary for humanity and the UNSC. I do not try to ponder on these things, these these thoughts, these these opinions you're asking me. Therefore, I have none. And what about odds? That was different. How so? He was one of us. One of us? You mean a Spartan? Romeo squad? No, I mean... What you mean is you only care about your squad. What about humanity and the UNSC? Like you said earlier. What about your opinions? I thought you had none. All right. I do have opinions, but... But not on this war or any of the others we fight in. Excellent job, Alexander. You do have a soul under that metal. You were testing me. Why? Almost every Spartan I've met has either lost their humanity to Oni, or Oni suppressed their humanity, and is losing it by the day this conflict rages on. You still have yours, and so does most of your squad. Never forget where you came from, Alexander, because if you lose that, I don't think you'd make it off the ship alive. Yes, sir. Charles, what... What's your opinion on war? I never experienced grass until I was 14, you know. All the soon-to-be Spartans on the Oni testing facility, or home for short, thought it was a big thing. Like taking your first steps or something ridiculous like that. That's because Oni never let us outside to experience open air. Like it was some kind of virus. I was actually excited at first, but when they finally did though, I wasn't impressed. All I could think about was war, and how I could use the environment to help me gain an advantage against the insurrection and these complex scenarios. I looked at the others, to my surprise, they were thinking the same thing I was. They just stood there, and looked at a patch of green, just like me. Then we all went back inside and did more military exercises. I saw Oni taking notes while we were outside. They didn't write down much, as they were expecting the same outcome as last. That mentally stuck with me to this day. I tried asking myself a couple weeks ago when we were back on reach, when the war is going to be over with the Covenant, what will I do? Will I just cease to exist? Or maybe go back in society, if there still is one? Then I realized there's always war, no matter what you do. There's always some group of people, alien or human, that want more. And if they have to kill thousands of people to get there what they want, then so be it. It's the will of the gods, people, rights. Whatever they say, it all comes down to one word. Greed. 
I never thought of it that way, sir. You don't have to. It's what I've 